so we charged uh, the camera a bit with the power bank we are now eating a kind of dinner at a cheap restaurant uh, I don't remember the name Supernatural I believe it's called we ordered homemade iced tea and a normal tea my wife ordered a chicken salad and I ordered uh, a rice salad I believe uh, which is coming up soon oh yeah I started eating and I forgot to film mine so mine is uh, chicken with rice and uh, vegetables dumplings uh, we'll tell our verdict afterwards I guess right get a small dessert and uh, in around 45 minutes we'll go to the train station to go back to Dendermonde because otherwise it gets very late like one hour of uh, riding with the train but Antwerp is very lovely we really like it a Jesuit church So we got our ice cream, looks pretty natural. Saffron. Yours is saffron with uh, pistachio. Yeah, and quite big uh, chunks. Oh, yeah, scoops as well. Yeah. Mine is uh, Oreo cookies with uh, Oma's apple tart, so um, grandma's apple cake. So here we are back at the big square with the town hall an ice cream and uh, less people the crowd is gone it's pretty beautiful here enjoying the last moments in our last Belgian province capital what do you think of Antwerp? it's very nice yeah, I can just uh, confirm that. It's a very nice atmosphere. Nicer than Ghent and Mon. It's quite classy. And not that many homeless people or people with drugs or anything. No, exactly. I don't see many problems. I guess when you go to the outskirts or in the north, uh, you will see people that are more like that but here in the center it's pretty everything is pretty much under control so it's safe to walk here maybe not at night but yeah we can only recommend Antwerp uh, I would say our three favorite places or cities in Belgium are uh, Antwerp, Brugge and Brussels without any order because each one has its own charm yeah think so yeah no. and I never liked uh, big cities but somehow they Belgian people really know how to make big cities feel like big villages so and yeah note on the restaurant where we were yeah it was pretty nice very Tasty food. Um, uh, good prices for this um, time of inflation. Yeah, so it's called Supernatural and it's Asian modern cuisine. Um, they speak English because they have a waiter that doesn't speak Dutch. And um, we found the taste pretty nice. The only thing that was not so nice is that. Um, they didn't list the ingredients, they just said veggies and I didn't know that they would put um, zucchini on it and uh, bell pepper and I can eat bell pepper, yes, but I don't really like it 
and zucchini I cannot eat it at all. I no. find it super disgusting. Some people cannot really handle the taste. It's no, exactly. It has some kind of chemical that some people cannot. Yeah, there are also some people who are uh, allergic to nightshades. So uh, tomato, eggplant. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Zucchini is eggplant, maybe that word doesn't exist. No, no wait. Zucchini is courgette. Okay, yeah. Eggplant is aubergine. So, um, courgette. Courgette is not a nightshade. Eggplant is. Yeah, but yeah, there are some people who have allergies, and I think they should just list them all. Yeah. Yeah. But apart from that, very nice drinks as well. Amazing homemade iced tea. Everything organic. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, I would say, apart from that remark, everything perfect. And yeah, we are coming to the end. We can stop it whenever we want. Let's say goodbye. See you on our next adventures. And uh, let's close off the series of the 12 Belgian provinces with this beautiful image of the big square. Ruben.